Hey guys, Todd here. Today we're going to install the Xtane Trifecta 2.0 on this 2022 Toyota Tundra. Now, the only tool we'll be using is a provided Torx wrench. Make sure you're subscribed to our channel to stay up to date with our latest content. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, now in your kit, you're gonna have four hanger brackets. This is the top of the hanger bracket. When you look at the back, you're gonna have four sets of holes. What we're gonna do is go to the second set from the top. What we're gonna to do to install that is take our threaded aluminum block and line up the threaded holes to the holes in the hanger bracket. And then what we need to do is start our bolts into those threads. The way I like to do that is take our supplied Torx wrench, line it up, set it in there, and get them started. Just go a few turns to get it started. Go to the next one. All right, once those are started, this is your assembled hanger bracket. We're gonna do that to all four of them. Okay, next what we're gonna do is go to our deck rail system in our truck. Now I've already moved our tie down cleats towards the center. Uh, next we've got a, a plug on, our, on the end of our deck rail system. What we do is we push in on that plug and it'll slide right out. We're gonna set that to the side for right now. Next we're gonna take our hanger bracket that's assembled. This aluminum block is going to slide into the deck rail system. That's a super tight fit. Let's just be patient with it, get it lined up, and slide it in. Repeat that on the back side and also for the opposite side of the truck. All right now, this is how the cover is going to come out of the box. What we're going to do is set it up on top of our bed caps, make sure that our clips are facing towards the cab of the truck. Then we're going to pull it all the way up to the bulkhead, make sure the bulkhead portion of the cover is over top of the bulkhead on the truck. We're going to bring it almost all the way where it touches the cab and we're gonna center it side to side. Once we've got it centered, we're gonna undo the clips on the cover and then gently fold it back to the tailgate. This is going to allow us to align it side to side to the back of the truck. And once we have it at the back, actually this is already pretty straight, so make sure it's nice and uh, centered side to side, then gently again fold it towards the front so we don't shift the alignment of the cover. And once we're here, we can go ahead and go underneath and set our front clamps. Okay, next what we're going to do is set our clamps. Now I'm going to show you what we're going to do on the driver's side. We're going to do the exact same thing on the passenger side. So this is our bracket that we just installed into the deck rail system. This is the hanger bracket. What we're going to do is we're going to slide it over and line it up to the bow on the bottom of the cover. We've got uh, a tether strap, and also here is our clamp uh, that is going to lock onto our hanger bracket. Now, typically our clamp is on the wrong side of the tether bracket, so what we're gonna do is slide our tether out of the way. We're gonna come back to that in just a moment. Um, and then we're gonna rotate our clamp down to where it lines up uh, that way we can get this lined up nicely and then move the clamp back out of the way. Now we can go ahead and hold this up against the deck rail system and use our provided Torx wrench and tighten it down. We also want to make sure that this is kind of lifted up a little bit, just like so. Now, no need to over tighten these, just get them nice and snug. Next, so we can go ahead and slide our clamp back over. We're going to rotate it underneath the hanger bracket. Once it's rotated underneath, we're going to go ahead and start twisting our clamp until it makes contact. Then once it makes contact, we're going to give it just a few more turns to snug the, uh, the cover down to the bed caps. What this does is this draws the whole cover down. And there we go. Next, we're going to go ahead and bring our tether strap back over. Now on your tether strap, you're gonna notice a few different components here. One is gonna be this aluminum block. What we're gonna do is unthread our star knob from the aluminum block a good ways. Then we're gonna take that aluminum block and slide it into our deck rail system, making sure this part of the bracket is underneath the deck rail. Once that has been slid in, we can go ahead and tighten our, our star knob. All right, and there we go. Just go ahead and repeat the same on the opposite side. All right, now go ahead and fold the cover back to the tailgate. Once you do that, 
this bow right here will need to be lined up to our other clamp brackets. So go ahead and slide that over. Next, we're gonna have our rear clamps. Now these clamps are kind of special in that once they get to about this angle right here, they don't wanna slide side to side anymore. You need to have it lifted up to get it slid over. Um, now what we're gonna do is rotate that down so that we can line up uh, the bracket, move our clamp back out of the way. And just like on the front, we're gonna use our provided uh, Torx wrench. Go ahead and tighten that down. And lift up on it a little bit. And go ahead and slide this over to where this is directly over top of the bracket. Slide it down, pull on the handle, and get it underneath the bracket. Repeat the same for the opposite side. Well, that concludes the installation. If you found this video helpful, make sure and give us a thumbs up. If you want to know more about the product, check the link down in the description below. And as always, if you have any questions, you can call the experts or visit us online.